everyone. Today I'm going to show you what I think is the best mascara. I've used mascara for years. It's my favourite piece of makeup. If I had to get rid of all my makeups and only keep one item, it would be mascara. I feel without it that I don't look awake enough and that it really makes such a change to my whole face. So let's go and see what I think is my favourite and best mascara. What I personally think to be the best mascara is the L'Oreal Lash Paradise. I love it because it's easy to apply. It actually gives a false eyelash effect without being clumpy, without the flakes. I would find a lot of mascaras, I end up with them up here, down here, uh, needing to retouch them during the day, whereas with this I don't. It's also very easy to apply, but yes, it gives the false look, but also a very natural look. It definitely lengthens, it definitely volumes, and what I like about it is the castor oil. Castor oil is something I use every single night on my eyelashes and eyebrows before I go to bed just to give them that extra condition to help them stay strong, grow, etc. And I like the fact that this formula has it in it as well. So I'm going to show you me applying it on one eye first of all and then you can see the difference between both eyes, what's on and what isn't on and see what you think. Before I apply mascara I always come and then curl my eyelashes as I find it helps to make the mascara application easier as well as making the eyelashes stand out more. I've recently purchased this from Revolution the Little Lash Comber. It does look a bit scary being metal but for years I used plastic ones and they always broke. So this one is actually really really good. I'll show you how I use it. As I said, it does look quite daunting, but it's really good. Also, instead of like the plastic ones, it is curved to the shape of the eye. So I go up a couple of times and then I go down with it also. It has got little prongs at each edge so that you're not actually going to hit your skin with the sharp bits. Not that they're sharp as such, but they're not as rounded and you don't really want to damage under your eye. So that's now combed. And I'll go in with the curlers. Again, Revolution curlers. I always find after having eyelash curlers for a long time, I lose the the little part it becomes loose the little rubber bit so i recently got these as well along with the comb just clamp the lashes in and hold for a few seconds and then just kind of boost them up a little bit with my finger and then i'll curl them again Apologies for the little mirror blocking out half of my face, but I can't do mascara without a small mirror up close. Okay, and now I'm going to apply the mascara to this eye. You can already start to see a difference in the eye that has been combed and curled compared to the eye that hasn't been. So, lash mascara. Lash Paradise, sorry. Just a normal shape brush. Quite a lot does come out. So I just uh, brush it off a little bit in the edge. Um, a good thick brush, not a curled one. I, I don't like the ones that are, are curved. I just can't seem to manage those personally. But this, this type I like. So I'll start by showing you this eye. Do get quite a bit extra sometimes on and you just need to get rid of that.
Okay, so that's top eyelash completed. And now I'll do the bottom. second coat now to the top. Okay. It definitely makes a big difference. Certainly appear with more volume and longer. Not clumpy at all. And a very natural look. It certainly does lengthen them. It's, it's bringing them up almost to my eyebrows. It makes the eye look bigger as well. So you can see the difference. Now I'll do the second eye. And again, just the same as before. I'll go through the, uh, the combing and curling. Done. That's a natural and a more wide awake look. Easy to apply. Not, uh, not like hard feeling. Sometimes you get mascaras and they can feel quite crunchy or crispy. That does feel, it does feel soft. Personally, I think it's very natural looking, um, despite definitely a false, false eye look, false eyelash look, but natural. So at present, yes, that's my favourite. I have tried so many mascaras over the years, uh, mainly L'Oreal. Uh, I have also tried Lancome, Maybelline. Clarins, Clinique, you name it, I've tried it in mascara. As I said earlier, it is my favourite item of makeup. But at present, this is my favourite and the best. And it lasts all day as well. I don't need to top it up at any point. So hopefully that's of some help as a review to show you how the Lash Paradise works on myself. If you like this video, please do like and subscribe. And I will see you the next time.